Hello, I'm Bradley and welcome to my channel. Today we're talking about hair product and it's a product which I have recently come across. It's completely new. I haven't actually come across a product like this at all before. Um, you could say there are some similar products out there, but this is certainly a new one for me. Who's it by? Let's jump straight in. So it's by Schwarzcroft and it's the Got To Be. And I have to admit, it's one of my favourite ranges of all products. I try a whole host of all different products all the time. I'm dropping in and out of all different product choices, but I always come back to the Schwarzcroft Got To Be range. My favourite product, which you will probably have already have known from a lot of my clips, is the Schwarzcroft Got To Be Glue. Now there is a reason why I am showing you both of these in just a moment. Let's continue with the product which I was talking about first of all. So this is a new product. Okay, I purchased this from Superdrug. It's on offer at the moment for £3. I will be honest, I don't know the normal price at the moment. I was trying to find that out, but I couldn't actually find that information at the moment. Um, but however, I really don't think it will stay at £3. But if you can find this on offer, a really, really great buy. So let's jump straight into it. So it's sleek black packaging. So for me, straight away, I would be comfortable as a man buying this product. And of course, if you were a woman buying this product as well, it would be absolutely fine. In terms of smell, it is very sort of stereotypical of a hair product. It's got that really like a hairspray hair product sort of smell but it's quite fresh it's quite crisp so it's not overwhelming it's nice and fresh um, and it's certainly something which I'd be really really comfortable using in terms of packaging really modern really sleek like the black color and um, going into the name let's just give you that information here so roaring high sprayable clay constructor or quiff styles texture define matte effect and it's a hold level of four so don't forget that's quite high when we go to the freeze hold which is a six. So this is really ultimate hold. This is really high holding hair spray as a free spray. So this is a four. But bear in mind, this is a product which you would use for styling your hair, getting that construction in your hair to create the style you want. So let's go back into it. So Roaring High, sprayable clay constructor for Quiff Styles. Now, I've seen this first of all, and the thing which I always look out for with products is for volume and texture and for height, making your hair thicker, fuller. Um, I have a lot of hair. I have fine hair. Very often I refer to it as thin, which possibly I shouldn't do. It's quite fine and I have quite a lot of it and when I say that I mean that when my hair is shampooed and conditioned and when it's dry it flops it sits very very flat to my scalp and it's really quite difficult to get a style into it so therefore I'm using texturizing powders by the Schwarzkopf got to be range again that's a favorite product of mine and um, for example I'm using prep sort of treatment sprays and things just to lift that hair away from my scalp which works um, and this is a product which you would put in there. So you would use your shampoo, your conditioner. So if you have fine textured hair, whether you're a man or a woman, I would always recommend a volumizing formula and something which is going to work with you to creating that thicker, fresh canvas to get your style started. This product here, so Roaring High Sprayable Clay Constructor. After you have dried your hair, so you've shampooed, you've conditioned your hair, you've dried it off. If you wanted to use a treatment to make sure your hair is a little bit thicker, for example, a root lifting spray, Schwarzkopf got to be actually have one as well, and that's for volume. I think it's called Volume Maniac, which is really, really good too. It's a root booster, so you could spritz that through your hair first of all. I haven't done that today. I'm going to go into what I've actually done today. I've just shampooed and conditioned my hair, dried my hair off. Nothing too special. I've gone with the front just with my uh, sort of rectangular, sort of normal square brush, which you can buy anywhere, and lifted the front up and really, really directed that towards the ceiling and back over my scalp, and then on each side, lifted that one up towards the ceiling and then over to the opposite side of my scalp and of course this side over as well. Then after everything's dry, I will be honest, it does flop, it sits quite flat. So to get a style like this, I'd have to use a lot of product. Here is where this comes in. So this sprayable clay constructor for quiff styles, I would think that if you wanted any more height or thickness, uh, thickness, <laughs> if you wanted any sort of thicker, sort of more texture, or if you wanted more hair to create a certain style, this would be a great product. I will be very, very honest. My first impression of using this product, I could have thrown it in the bin because you think it's going to be a bit more like a dry shampoo. I've tried men's dry shampoo before and it helps, but I don't like how it sits on your scalp. I really, really don't like that about those type of sprays and I don't actually choose to use them. This spray is a clay. Now, the only thing, the only way I can kind of relate this to is if you're using a clay or a putty, it really lifts the hair up and almost really pulls away from the scalp. With this spray, well, why I really didn't like it first of all is because you think it's going to be dry in texture and it is but when you spray it all in and what I actually tend to do as a tip actually here is hold my head off to the side or literally lean over in front with my hair flopping down and then spray all the way through 
don't be shy with it, spray all the way through. Then when I threw my head up and I looked in the mirror, it seemed ever so slightly wet, which is not what I'm looking for when I'm coming to style my hair. In terms of that then, I thought to myself, absolutely horrendous product, throwing it in the bin. Then I went to the mirror and I started combing my hair into the, like a pompadour style. Anybody who doesn't know what a pompadour style is, it's like the Elvis Presley inspired hairstyles on the 1950s styles. A little bit like what I've got here, but usually it's a little bit more uniformed at the side and possibly even more hype than what you can see here. First of all, as I say, didn't like it, went to the mirror, went to comb it into style and it completely changed. Yes, it was a little bit wet. But however, once you comb it into, into the shape you want it, straight away that hair was standing away from my scalp. It was giving it much more texture, much more sort of thickness. And I said that word again, didn't I? Much more thicker. And it was almost like it gave you like a, a foundation and it really binded to your hair and it really, really lifts everything up. So in a way, it gives you that almost foundation for a really nice, high, voluminous sort of style, whether you're a man or a woman, of course. Now for me... As soon as I seen that, I was really quite interested to think, actually, I thought it was dry, but it wasn't. It was a little bit more moist in the hair, which straight away I didn't like, because if you've got fine texture head like me, if you've got a bit more of a wetter product, straight away if you do a volumized style like this, if it's slightly wet or slightly damp with a product, you can see right the way down to my scalp. If you get some sunshine, throw that into the mix. It looks horrendous because you can see how fine your hair is. Really, really don't like that. So... After, when I brushed it through, that sort of wetness faded away. I kind of combed it out. It went a little bit more drier which was amazing. And then what it recommends is to grab the blasting free spray, so the one I showed you, this one here, to spray all over to fix it in shape, which it works amazingly. When I come to use this product again, I've used it about four or five times now. Okay, four or five times. First time, like I said, I thought I was just going to absolutely throw it out. Second time, I knew what I was expecting. Threw my head over in front of me, hair sort of, after it's dry, sort of literally hanging down, spray it all through, Give that a little bit of a massage and then you can see that the hair just literally falls upwards sounds strange doesn't it literally falls towards the ceiling and it's much more easier to style so for example if you were going for more of a what i quite like to do as well as a style like this but however parting down the side bit of volume with a side sort of slick piece and then lots of volume on one side really really amazing if you've got the finest of hair this would be a really great product just because i've said it's a bit more of a moist texture when you spray it in first of all it will still work with you because even though it looks slightly like that time you've combed it through and you've got it into the style you want to wear it or you're moving your hand through your hair into the style you want to wear it will literally make your hair so much more easier to style a problem very often i have because my hair now is literally touching my top lip when I throw my hair over, over sort of a lean over and spray this product all through my hair and then come back up to style my hair, I've got the front done, then the sides sit outwards ridiculously, like some sort of weird hat going on. And then time I've combed it through, this side flops down. And then time I've done this side, this side flips back down. So I'm using more and more product. With this, when I leant back upwards, the sides were fine and literally just a quick brush over, brush over, breaking it up with my fingers, didn't have to bother. So it literally halved my time of styling. Big voluminous styles with huge amounts of volume so it's a really really great product really like that so it says here for quiff styles absolutely if you wanted it a little bit more uniform like what i've got here great if you wanted to break it up with fingers amazing because you can lift it even higher because you don't have to worry about sort of parts sort of showing or opening up so you can really get that nice high lift and texture and sort of twist your fingers as you lift that hair up it really creates an amazing style let's tell you a little bit about it on the back here so it's got to be got to be so you want to go high got to be will take you higher sculpt your high rising quiff with got to be roaring high sprayable clay constructor your sculpted look with a matte finish is just a spray away the sprayable clay constructor gives structure and hold from the roots to the tips big loud and proud how to use shake well before use in short bursts on dry hair to sculpt and define your style make it last and then it says here if you have a problem with the nozzle on the product and then it's got for the perfect result here lock in place we've got to be blasting freeze spray which is this one and i love that how schwarzkopf got to be sort of tie all their products in which is amazing so for example just straight off the hip here if you wanted a great style using a volumizing shampoo and conditioner okay or for example just something which is going to look after your scalp boost that real high strength um 
hair growth there's go for example one i always like to use the hybrid sensitive caffeine shampoo then if you're going with a conditioner any sort of volumizing conditioner sometimes it's got sort of proteins in it's got sort of soy uh, soy proteins to, to bind to the hair making it thicker um, and sometimes you'll find that wheats are always added into those sort of conditioners to make the hair stand away from the scalp one which i really really like is the organics uh, it's in like a, a purple container, thicker, fuller hair, I believe. It's got the biotin and collagen in there. It's a really great conditioner for binding to the hair and making it thicker. You really, really do know the results. As you know from my channel, I chop and change with a lot of different products. Perfect shampoo to really get the growth, really perfect scalp environment for your hair. Conditioner, boosting the hair, what you've got. Treatment, for example, Schwarzkopf got to be a uh, Volumaniac root boosting spray. It's in a pink and yellow bottle. Really, really cool. And then jumping in with that, after your hair's all dry, you've got that structure there. You want a little bit more. Go in with the Schwarzkopf Got To Be Roaring High Sprayable Clay Constructor. Bit of a mouthful, isn't it, saying that? Then you've got the Perfect Spray, spray all over the top with the Blasting Free Spray. Yes, it's a lot of products for your scalp, but what I must say, if you're using a lot of products, I use lots of products. But if you're making sure that you're shampooing and conditioning your hair correctly and... What I would suggest, if you do wear a lot of products, shampoo your hair once to get rid of the product, then two, so you get the benefits from the shampoo on your scalp and hair. Then, of course, condition afterwards. Really great tip. I really hope you've enjoyed this uh, review in regards to this product today. I have to admit, from when I first bought it, I thought absolutely rubbish, to now I'm using it all the time when I come to doing these real voluminous styles, which I really, really love. Some of you may know from my channel, I have recently suffered the loss of my Alaskan Malamut, which is absolutely torn, is my fluffy best friend. And he's absolutely, loss of him has absolutely torn my life apart, to be honest with you. So I haven't really bothered with hairstyles and things. Um, only sort of in the last couple of days, I've started to sort of change things up a little bit. Usually I just slick my hair back in a gel, 1920s look, and that's pretty much me. Um, but yeah, it's been really quite difficult. But there... Uh, there we go. Still very, very difficult, very, very raw. But I have enjoyed doing this clip, nevertheless, today. And I really hope you have, if you come across it. I have found this product on Superdrug at the moment, but I'm sure you can buy this online. I imagine time you watch this clip, the price will vary. But if you can get it for £3 in Superdrug, a fantastic buy, and you will not regret it. So, once again, thank you very much for watching this clip. And until next time, we will see you then. Bye-bye now. I almost forgot. How did I style my hair today? Let's just run through this very, very quickly. So I have gone from freshly shampooed and conditioned hair first thing this morning, very bright and early. Then what I have done is I have gone in and just dried my hair off. I always like to use my favourite sort of brush, which is the small radial brush by Damon, I believe. And that's really, really great for lifting right in at the roots and directing it towards the ceiling and over towards the back of your scalp. And then from the sides, lifting up from your roots up towards the ceiling and then over. And then again, obviously, on the last part here, lifting from the roots up towards the ceiling and over the direction of your head. Doing that all through your hair and then, of course, just making sure that it is nice and flat and smooth with the hair dryer at the back of the nape of your neck so the hair smooths down. If you've got a haircut like me, for example, as you can see, I've recently just had this done. You've got a defined line here. So this is a naught all the way up. And then I think we've gone to about a one, then up to a two, not blended. We've got that defined line which comes down to a point. So always making sure that the hair is nice and flat and smooth down at the bottom. Literally, with your fingers, you can then pull the hair towards so you've got a nice feature there if not what i always suggest is grabbing a comb or a brush and then pulling it downwards right the way down through the back grabbing a mirror and you can see that all the hair then sways down in towards the bottom bit bit like sort of like a bit of a waterfall coming all the way down into the bottom of your nape of your neck how about to start my hair so my hair is very soft and sort of floppy falls very very flat we have gone in with the product today of the Roaring High Sprayable Clay Constructor. Sprayed all the way through. I literally lean over, okay, spray all the way through my hair on the roots, come back up. Don't be shocked. It will be slightly damp. But I promise you, when you go to combing or moving with your fingers through your hair to ensure style, it dries off and it gives you that real structure, that kind of almost like scaffolding for that style you want to create. What I've gone in through today is very, very simple. I've literally, with my fingers, because I've dried my hair back, bearing in mind, with the dryer, you're creating that style. So what I tend to do in the front here is literally keep the brush, keep rolling up so you get a bit more of a quiff base at the front here. Then with the product, this will make it so much easier for you to style your hair. Then what I do is literally comb it through gently. You don't want to flatten your head, so really just keep things light here. And then literally brush all the way over. But what I am tending to do, rather than just going straight over, literally brush it off slightly to the side. Pull things up slightly off to the side. Here, pull over. 
and then literally so you're pulling it over and you're leaving here and in the front you're pulling up off to the side everything's slightly off to the side and then the front here i'm lifting up the brush so everything's straight and then off to the side here again just literally flowing around the side here if that's enough for you it could well be fine it recommends this it's my favorite product i spray it all over my hair literally it dries rock cement and it's fantastic because with all sort of mixtures of weathers at the moment really really good whether you're here in the uk whether you're in america goodness knows where in the world we all get mixtures of weather and really really great product to have literally in your hair armory or products so really if you can try and use that one after this style you will not regret it it holds your style all day so that's how i style my hair today literally nothing to looks looks difficult to do it's really not grab a mirror make sure your hair literally swoops down very often if i'm in a bit of a rush it will go off to one side it ruins a complete look if you've got the front here making sure the front's up nice and high everything sort of swooped back nice and tidy grab a mirror and if it doesn't flow grab a brush or a comb literally start from the back and then just go downwards because what it does is it pulls the hair inwards and you get this nice sort of feature there we go okay thanks very much for watching once again and until next time we will see you then i mean at this time no more to add bye now <laughs>